Hey, I found Finn's setup. The Oscorp Science Center. It's closed for renovations. Oh my... Our energy converter that won the middle school science fair. That's how she's gonna finish making the new form unstable enough to blow up Roxxon Plaza. Whoa. It's like she picked it to get back at you. Maybe she did. <sighs> Thanks, Genki. It's my job. Speaking of, time to help your mom evacuate Harlem. Later. Okay. Oscorp Science Center. Finn needs to know what'll happen if she goes through with her plan. And if she won't listen, I'll take the new form. Destroy it if I have to. Should we... Do you want to think about your uncle a little bit? Because you were all like, no, it can't be. Which is... Sometimes we know the truth, but we're just blinding ourselves on purpose. A friendly neighborhood user just spotted a weapons deal going down. We'll get him. That is one shady looking weapons deal. Traffic, Spider-Man! Ditch the stuff! Why can't you sell something nice? Like, stickers! I'm sorry. Pizza. This one was a stealth combo one. I got the 10 combo, but I, I just swung in there. The one time they tell me to use stealth and I don't. Ow. Are you sure? And that's one more arms deal stopped in progress. Don't oh, work me. Oh, I thought somebody was in the trunk and I forgot to rescue them. No, it's just this guy. Show up. <laughs> Not looking for another vigilante lecture. That's part of Kwanzaa. Was there any? I was just thinking. Are there any more character thingies we haven't read yet? I don't think so, right? Everyone's here now. Everyone's unsuitable. Oh. Rhino got a makeover. Update. Turns out Rhino never made it to the raft. Simon Krieger decided to keep him as a giant, mean, muscly enforcer pet. Oh, and gave him new armor. Cool, cool, cool. Very cool, huh? Tinkerer update. Whatever the Tinkerer's plan is, it's tied to whatever happened to Rick. Another update. The Tinkerer wants to blow up Roxxon Plaza. She's planning to attack before it opens so there won't be casualties, but still. I can't let her do this. Still more updates. The Tinkerer's plan to destroy Roxxon Plaza didn't account for updates to the reactor. If she goes through with it, she'll wipe out Harlem. I have to tell her. Genius level intellect. But... Why can't we just just text her? She won't listen to us, but she has to read the message to know it's me. So she has to read it before she blocks us, right? Unless if she blocked us already? You gotta try, Miles. And I suppose... This would also be a good time to go back to the main suit. Yeah, we saw some damage on it earlier, which I guess is the intended effect that we're supposed to see. So I'll keep doing that. What the hell? Oh my god! That was green. Sorry about this, nephew. I knew it. Can't let you go back out there. Let Krieger and the Tinkerer kill each other. Go back to being Spider-Man when the heat dies down. And what? Just hide down here? <laughs> I don't get to pick and choose when I'm Spider-Man. I gotta stop Finn. No, you gotta survive. I've been trying to teach you that, but you don't listen. You want me to survive so bad? Why sell me out to Krieger? Wasn't a sellout. Yeah. I'm serious. You were never supposed to get caught. But I did. Krieger broke our deal. You want it back in the family, and that's the best you could do? I saved your life. You threw me in a cell. To protect you. Like this is protecting me? Damn it, Miles. I'm not going to lose you too. And I'm not going to let people die just to save my skin. You underestimated me. <laughs> Damn it, no! Whoa, really? Don't fight me on this! I don't want to, but I can't stay down here. Then I'll do what I have to. Keep you safe. His cloaking tech. I need to short it. Is that shorted? 
This isn't about me at all. It's about you. You're afraid. Don't you turn this on me. You can't counter every trick. When are you going to understand that I have to fight for this city? When are you going to understand you can't do that? I'm sorry, Uncle. You don't realize I'm the only one trying to save you. And I'm trying to save everyone else. <sighs> oh. I mean, I'm looking pretty good right about now. Didn't your mentor teach you about picking your battle? He taught me to put other people ahead of myself. Stay back, nephew! What the? You got tricked. Rocks on counter. You don't get how the real world works. Dog eat dog. Not if we make it better. I gotta stay away from those things. Yup, yup, yup. You don't get it. You never fought for anyone but yourself. Maybe that's why I'm still alive. That's a very cowardly way to live, though. I'm not one for a superhero. You throw yourself at enemies you can't beat. No who else did that. Don't say his name. You want your mom to bury you too? I won't let you. Holograms? More tech from your buddies at Roxxon? I adapt. You can't keep up. You're naive, nephew. Still the kid looking up to Spider-Man. No, I'm the kid who knows people are looking up to me. It's this one. Not that one. You are never going to accept me as Spider-Man. The risk I gotta take? You're right. I'm done letting my family die trying to play hero. Get back. How far will you take? You're going to kill yourself proving you deserve that mask? If that's what it takes. Come on. Give yourself away! So we get slow and steady. Man, please! Don't do this! Throw your life away! I'll do what I have to! Just like you! It was this one! It's this one! Or not! I made so many excuses for you! We would have been alright before Spider-Man got a hold of you! There's too many! I can't keep up with mine. Let's get some of those other dudes quickly. The mine got him. I'm younger than you, Uncle. I know I messed up. I let you down. But we're family. Family? <laughs> that didn't stop you from lying to me, manipulating me, fighting me? Being family isn't enough anymore. Doesn't have to be like this. You, me, hating each other? That's how it happened between me and your dad. I don't want to repeat that. I don't either. But I can't be the person you want to turn me into. I can't turn my back when people need me. I have to be better than that. 
feel like we're repeating it with Finn, though. We're going against her, fighting her. But we believe ourselves to be right. That's the difference, I think. Genki! My uncle just kidnapped me! Locked me up! What? Dude, are you okay? I had to fight him! Then I said, I told him, we're done! For good! I'm sorry. That's... That can't have been easy. It's what I had to do. I'm headed to the Science Center. Call me if things get bad in Harlem. I will. Good luck, Spider-Man. Now we're understanding why our dad had to cut Uncle off. Get understanding it firsthand, pretty much. Back to the Science Center for real this time. But my uncle... He's still around. He might come up later. I don't know. This is your last chance to upgrade gear and abilities. Yes, we are ready. Wait, just hold on. So just to have a victory... Okay, I was gonna say victory lap around here, and then I noticed this says 85% because there's still two side missions we haven't unlocked yet. Hopefully that's just because the end of the game gives some missions, because everything else is 100. In the Got a app... Crime ping from the app. A donation stand's being robbed. These ones are all... Yeah, I guess we just wait until afterwards. Let's go! You see him close to renovation, and the underground moves right in. Finn's gotta be inside. Dude, this is... out in the open. Let's have a quick look at the amount of people jumping all over the place. There's a lot of freaking people here. Who's looking at him? Nobody. Again, getting the guys up top first will probably make it easier for us. Especially the guys with the giant lasers. Yo, they have the whole Oscorp Science Center just under lockdown here. Should we get those two guys first? Their lasers go really far. How should we do it? I'm fine. I'll be okay. You were at the opera house. Move for him. I said I'm fine. Shut up. Oh, they're getting get sick too. Away from me or suck it up. We don't have time for this. They're getting sick. Well, one of them just volunteered away. I guess that's fine. Oh wow, you can see my shadow on the ground there. You see it? Right here? That's so far and they still have it. You know, I'm not even I'm not even able to run this at max graphic setting on PC. If you do, that might be even crazier. Uh let's see. A whole bunch of grouped up people here. Oh, one guy on the roof. Might be able to get that one. Very good. Very good. Total- yeah, we're definitely getting better at stealth after all that practice. After all the traversal challenges, it wasn't for nothing. one side down. Now we'll do the other side. <laughs> Spidey has to rely on a little bit of... Where are the people talking? Yeah, Spidey definitely has to rely on a little bit of ingenuity. Because we're not that... We're not bulletproof. Unfortunately.
Oh, 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 oh. Thank you for coming up voluntarily. It's really simple if you can distract people. Just make them look the other way. I almost feel like I'm doing a challenge. Okay, we got the two sides. Now we just go straight into the middle. There's uh, quite a few more people I haven't marked. Right. I don't have any mines. There's two guys on the roof, is it? Is that guy on the roof? Yes, he is. Okay, in that case, don't do that then. Oh, hold up. Thank you for coming. Oh, 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 oh. I was out of camouflage just now. Where'd she go? Oh, we have to do the whole shutting down power thing again. Where'd she go? Scary. I didn't kill her yet. Where they all go. Do I still have to defeat someone? Or is it a matter of turning off the right thingies again? I feel like there might be one person, one or two people. Yeah, it's this thingy. But how do I get in? Wait, there's someone there. I just saw them on the map. Like one red dot. Oh, hello. Sorry about that. All right. Let's see what kind of security they've got. Same kind of barrier they had at Gym Theater. I need to drain the generators. Yup. In those shacks. Which are locked and powered down. Need a new power source. Like that giant spinning mobile. Giant spinning mobile? Giant spinning mobile? Yeah, this will work. Wow, alright. Well, we have to begin with a source somewhere. Can this be the beginning of a source? No. So yeah, we have the little Oh, that is the beginning. That has electricity on its own. No, no, no. Um. This thingy? Where do you want to be? Where do you need to be? We want to power Flaps up. Won't reach. Here we go. What? Why won't it reach? It's right here, isn't it? Oh, I guess they want me to do this one first because I just moved it over. What? What? Oh, the angle is slightly off. It clips into the corner. Are you kidding me? Seriously? That's bizarre. Let me try moving it back in place again. Oh, we have to move it in a way that all three... There's three yeah, thingies. It doesn't line up. But I don't think this works either. You want all four corners to be opened by the way this is lined up, right? Right. Got it. Sticky and conductive. And then That's do the one. thing. Feeling good. Oh, this is gonna work. Yup. Oops. This is working. A couple more. 
Now this one is over here, which means... This isn't gonna work here, right? Because the... Oh, this one is. Wait, which one... What did this open? Oh, this is used for bringing it over here. No? There you go. Yes. I saw one more. I can't believe how well this is working. Don't jinx it. Don't say that. Why would you say that, Miles? Okay, thingamabob. Doodly do. Diddly da. Uh, do I have to? <laughs> boop, boop. Oh, it's all finished draining mm. the generators. There we go. Fantastic. Oh, sweet. Time to break the underground's toys. Well, don't approach it with that kind of angle. Finn's gonna get even more angry. The future of science is today. Finn? You hear? Well, the museum shop is all cleared out. Can't even steal some goodies. I mean, not that that's what I was thinking, but I'm just saying. Do they have a space exhibition? Winning the science fair, getting to show off our converter here. We were so proud. <sighs> Exhibit was down that hall. People change. The only constant in life is change, something, something. Underground cash. <laughs> You're gonna keep taking it. Three tech parts. Yeah. Ben? Shh. Come Jeez. on. We need to finish this. You and me. <sighs> She's got to be with our project down that hall. Check out the space shuttle. Wow. We're definitely going to fight here, though. Oh. The rocket game. Did I win or did she? Guess it doesn't matter now. If only things were so simple as a game. Much else around here? Well, we're definitely coming back. You see those racks? You see all the stuff we can knock down? Sea living. What? They have like an aquarium here? Come on, molasses! I want to see our project! Welcome while we're still young. Center, where tomorrow's innovation is today's reality. I'm coming, I'm coming. Hey, where'd they put us? I've got the museum map on my phone. Our project's in a special exhibit on the top floor. Can't wait to see our names on the little sign, like real scientists. Today, the Oscorp Science Center? Tomorrow, every major museum in the world. How old were we here? Maybe 16 or so? Did Finn get contacts? Ooh. Since the mid-20th century, scientists have envisioned human habitation beneath the sea. Looking out your window, someday, I'm you might that see that one. Brightly Power. Fish, you name one. Uh, Leviathan. Love it! Leviathan and Howard. What's Didn't this? Used to date a marine biologist? She's an astronaut now. Whoa, really? Wow. How'd she make that joke? 
That's pretty common, I guess. She was studying for her PhD in California and applied to the space program. Got accepted a year later. Pat, when's Rick gonna get here? He just texted. Said he was headed into the subway. <laughs> so it could be anywhere from 30 minutes to two hours? I'll have you Basically. Know I'm also very good at fixing our office copy. I was invested in the story about this girl, this person's girlfriend, ex-girlfriend, becoming an astronaut. Algae farms are the key to sustainable, healthy living beneath the sea. Commercial and industrial algae cultivation is already used in a number of products, from colorants to pharmaceuticals. I wonder what algae tastes like. Probably kale. Ugh, I hate kale. It's like a science, it's not an aquarium. There are some fish, but it's more technology focused. This model combines the design of a submarine with the deep sea integrity of an unmanned underwater vehicle. Oscorp's prototype would unlock new possibilities in humanity's ability to explore. Oh no. <laughs> you and I gotta get one of these. Bet we could build one out of a vacuum cleaner and some old tires if we put our minds to it. It'll probably be okay as long as you don't use a Logitech controller to control the submarine. It's so peaceful in here. Think underwater living sounds like science fiction? Think again. Yeah. Underwater habitats have been used around the world since the 1960s. This model proposes a permanent residence beneath the waves. Today, New Yorkers are building up to save space. Tomorrow, we could be building beneath the sea. Pass. What? You scared? Of sharks? The dark, tiny enclosed spaces? It's a no for me. The lack of oxygen. If anything goes wrong is a big one. The Earth is bigger than you think. 95% of the Earth's oceans remain unexplored and could be the next frontier in human habitation. It's weird to think how little we know about our own planet. We've been here for a while, but yeah. It's hard to explore really deep places. This dive suit is one of the first developed in the early 18th century. The first pressure-proof diving suit was developed with salvage work in mind. Today's suits such as these are used by salvage workers, scientists, and explorers. Think they'll let me try it on? Would love to see you try to walk around in that thing. Thanks for bringing Can't be worse than those shoes you wore to the spring yeah, dance. Wow. Oh, come on. What do you think? Yours were at least an inch higher than mine. Trust Oscorp <laughs> to shell out. Let's go to the main hall. Than it has any right to be. Wait till you see the Land Rovers upstairs. Land Rovers. I want to see the Land Rovers. Miles, don't T pose. <laughs> Just see the way he was running. Special exhibits upstairs. Oh, there's the elevator. We've got time to look around first. This is a space portion. What are these little pods? They said something about like, the key. Proposed habitats on Mars. Architectural innovations are the key to human survival on extraterrestrial planets. This model home would protect human inhabitants from the low temperatures on Mars. Hole in one. Check it out. You want a house on Mars? Sure. If I could bring my mics, audio setup, sampler. They won't let you take all that. They will if they want good music on Mars. Yeah. Oh, the rocket game. Wish we'd had museums like this where I grew up. We had to drive two hours to see something like this. Considering we spent really? an hour and a half in traffic, it's not that different. I keep saying. I want to play the rocket oh, game. Not on your own. I've been with that car longer than you. Ooh, we gotta play. Oh come on, it's just button mashing. So you admit defeat? The Never. Science Center is proud to Which button? Oh, faster! Come on, rocket buddy! Yeah! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Go, 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 go! Gotcha! Found something I'm better at than you. Not for long. <laughs> Let her win once, maybe. <laughs> come on! I'm going so slow right now. Yes, 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 yes! Ha <laughs> I still beat her! Yes. This game was made for me. Two wins does not a master make. 
How about three? She's so bad at this though, we're pretty... It's easy. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Up, 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 up! Go, 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 go! Faster! <laughs> She's only gonna get more tired. Ha! <laughs> That's a win for me! No way! That did not just happen! <laughs> Third time's a charm! I'm just better. Oh, they won't even... Close and you'll still be playing that thing! Okay, okay. I'm done. I was gonna stop, but they won't even let me play anymore. <laughs> I don't think we're looking to leave just yet. This is a huge museum, though. The fact that this rocket it game has nice like. Your dad to drop us off. We would have gotten here faster if you oh, turned on the sirens. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely would have made an entrance. Look at how many different people can play at the same time. This rocket game. It's a rich museum, Oscorp. This Oscorp rover, adapted from models currently used on the moon can be operated as a man or unmanned vehicle. Used to carry minerals and find water sources, the Oscorp rover would make exploration possible on Mars. Scans for minerals, carries people across toxic wastelands. What can't it do? Can you imagine driving this thing down fifth? Move, pedestrians. <laughs> <laughs> it would fit. It'll probably fit. Got another one here. What's this? Solar energy, already popular on Earth, could provide heat and electricity for space stations, shuttles, and extraterrestrial settlements. These Oscorp stickers show how flexible and affordable solar cells can be. Go on, take a sticker. Ooh, shiny. Ooh, shiny? Those are portable adhesive solar panels. Ooh, portable shiny. <laughs> I want one. This model proposes a terraforming and housing initiative on Mars, our closest neighbor in the solar system. This community is designed to draw on abundant water and counteract low temperatures, making it's like a whole little community on Mars. On Needs coffee shops and street art. Our summer series highlights the yeah, there's a lot of street art in Harlem, huh? I wonder if that's the case in the real Harlem. Spacecraft explore our planet, solar system, and galaxy. To communicate with them, scientists use radio antennas to send and receive messages across local and interstellar space. Oh, I bet the sound quality on these are dope. Not from space. I don't think I've ever been to a museum this rich looking, man. Like, they have so many exhibits and stuff. My god. Space bound through the stars. We ready or what about this one here? There's a tour? Do you have tickets for the special exhibit? Oh, um, our project is on display. Didn't think we needed tickets. You do, and we're sold out. Can't let you go upstairs. Thanks, anyway. That sucks. So, we need another way in. She said there's no more tickets. Right, but see that door? The hallway behind it wraps around to the elevator. Can't just break in. We have to! They're taking down the exhibit tomorrow, and then we'll never see it! Why'd you guys wait till the last day? Come on, kids! Deadlines! Locked! I recognize that kind of lock. If you shine a light at it, it'll open. The flashlights on our phones would work, but they won't reach. They will if we find a way to slide something reflective under the door. Something reflective. It'd be nice to find something mutable. Mutable? You mean changes shape? Look at you breaking out the fancy vocab. <laughs> Shut up. Mutable? Something we can pick out around here? We need something reflective. And something we can slide under the door, but still move around. Like a, a mirror or something? Well, you want to take a part of the exhibit, or...? I don't know how... How much... Like, all of this is stuck to the display. It's not like we can just... There was that metal display by the door. Hmm. Okay. Did we even look at that metal display? We might not have. Maybe that's why I don't remember it. 
Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Shape memory alloy. I could change the shape on the museum app. This stuff is crazy. Think that's it. Take it. Don't let anyone see. Oh, this is like it's kind of like the programmable matter stuff, huh? Maybe the basis for it. <laughs> oh man, sorry. Oh. All good. Heat. I still need something reflective. Did you call Dad back? Look how the external tools interface directly with the command module's computer. We could recreate the idea, but with a neural interface. It would overload our central power. Not if we integrated it over the entire mesh from multiple entry points. Hmm. Do you think you can handle it? With enough time and a lot of coffee? Absolutely. <laughs> I'll supply the coffee. Well done, Peter. I couldn't do this without you. Hmm. We should probably head back to the lab. We've overstayed our lunch break. Oh, Doc, I'm so sorry, but I've got to take the afternoon off. It's an emergency. Again? Peter, is something bigger going on? Perhaps at home? You know you can talk to me about it. Oh, I, I'm fine, but I'm sorry to run out on you again. Not at all. Work will be waiting when you get back. Thanks, Doc. This interaction really shouldn't have left such an impression on me, because at that point, at this point, we weren't Spider-Man yet. Oh, is he going to the exit? I'm just gonna stalk Pete a little bit. Integration over the mesh. That boy's mind never stops. He left. Oscorp Science Center. <laughs> Norman can't build anything without making sure his name's on it. Well, if you got the money, I guess. <laughs> Dr. Octavius. Okay, now that we have this, we'll just slide it over. But don't we need to get it at the right angle? The thingy we picked up feels like it can probably move at 90 degree angles. Can we get it to the right spot? I guess we'll find out. Whose parents are looking for who? Wait. I thought you wanted to... Oh. Did you- does the phone not work? We should look around for an energy display. Energy display? Ah, the solar panel stickers. Oh, look! Solar mirrors. And sticky on the back. Perfect for tricking a light-sensitive lock. Take one! It's free? I'll put the sticker on the metal. Let's go. It's free. And this place is rich. I've got the light. Tell me when the sticker's pointed at the sensor, and I'll turn it on. No one's looking at us yet. Gotta hurry. <laughs> yet. Can you get it at the right angle? Oh, I can rotate it. Well, which which is the ideal shape? Can you try it? We gotta try again. No, not quite. No, we should probably do it the other way. Like this, at least. It just goes the other way. Oh, this one looks a little bit promising, maybe. We did it! Come on! Our project awaits! So fishy. <laughs> We've been huddling by the door for 20 hours. That was awesome. I'm gonna miss doing stuff like this with you. What are you talking about? Uh, hello? You'll be at Brooklyn Visions next week. I won't. I'm not gonna vanish off the planet. We'll still hang out. You'll be busy. Not that busy. I'm gonna make time for us. Seriously. Okay. Ugh, this is getting mushy. Come on, let's head upstairs. And then what happens? We proceed to both be busy. Ah, <sighs> if only we could go back to the old times. The simpler times. You coming? I was the one who pressed the button. Hey, Dad. Hey, Miles. Hi, Mr. Davis. <laughs> Finn says hi. You kids having fun? 
Make sure you get a picture of your project. Dad, it's not a big deal. It's totally a big deal. Okay, okay, we'll get a picture. I love you, Dad. Bye. Is that lady gonna rat on us? She was like, hey! The kid's on the elevator! This is it! Our project's in the back. Think they got a converter all hooked up? Otherwise, what's the point? They'll need to feed biomass in, though. Maybe hook it up to a trash can. The Oscorp Science Station, positioned at one of two stable Lagrange points between Earth and the Moon, could one day be a permanent home for human scientists and explorers. Man, it'd be so cool to live on a space station. Well, if anything goes wrong, same deal with the underwater thing. You're not gonna have oxygen. Nuclear energy is the key to our future as we explore interstellar space. Fuel efficiency and transportation will be vital components in reaching and settling planets at the far reaches of our solar system and beyond. Oscorp Nuclear Reactor. Rick's working on something that's supposed to make nuclear energy obsolete. Do we get to know what it is? Nope. Roxxon's keeping it super secret. New form. But doesn't work quite yet. Cultivating agriculture in nutrient-enriched fluids, what we call hydroponics, could make farming in space a reality. Wonder if they can grow flowers in space. They're probably more interested in food. Why? You trying to impress someone? I like to be prepared. In case I get a crush on a cute astronaut. Pfft. Okay. You can steal the lady, the ex-girlfriend of the guy downstairs. One of humanity's greatest accomplishments came from the Apollo space program. We reached the moon. Since then, scientists have dreamed of traveling beyond and someday settling our solar system. Lunar module from the Apollo program. Hey, we can name our time capsule after that. How many Apollo missions were there? 16, 17, I think. Apollo 18. I like it. Hmm. Journey through the stars. Which one is ours? I want to make sure we don't touch it. Oh, it's that one, isn't it? Let's touch this one. This engine, used in the Apollo space program, is one of the most powerful inventions that uses liquid fuel. Today, Oscorp is building on that technology to maximize fuel efficiency, making deep space exploration possible. The most powerful single nozzle liquid fuel rocket engine ever made. I'd love to build something like that. I need to get that picture of you and our converter for your dad. If Finn really has genius level intellect. You ready to go? Not yet. I still haven't read everything. Are you? I'm a little tired and my feet are sore. Give me yeah. 15 minutes and then we can leave. No rush. It's not like we get out here often. If big museums are kind of tiring to go through, really easy to get tired. Is that your dream job? Oscorp scientist? Nah, can't see myself at a big company, but the R&D would be cool. Our project. I was gonna say, if Finn really has genius level intellect, people, big companies would be trying to recruit her left and right. Oh, ho, ho, wee! Would you look at that? Genuine award winning scientists. No one told us we were in the special exhibit. Ticket only. How'd you get in? Uh, I bought a ticket. How'd you get in? I bought a ticket. Not important. <laughs> <laughs> hey, huddle up. We need a picture. You gotta be in it too. You helped us get it working. Okay, okay, fine, fine, fine. Scoot over. All right. Say alleles! I am not saying that. <laughs> alleles? Is that even... Alleles. That kind of works. <sighs> Whoa, she's out for blood. Finn. Finn, you need to know. I'm done listening to you. Just yell it out loud. Just say it. Don't wait. 
I had to tell her what happened to the reactor. Oh! Don't let him follow the tank Oh! Holy crap, dude! I need a lot of help immediately. <gasps> they were just pummeling me. My God. Oh, oh God. This is my favorite museum. Well, they can get a renovation then, maybe. Great. Oh, I don't think we have time for this. They were coming in hot. You want to come over here? Do you want to come over here? No, they're not going to come. But they're waiting. <laughs> they're waiting. Oh! Thanks for the free healing, dummy. Can we at all do a stealthy thing? You guys aren't even dead. Oh, 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 oh! Do it out of here! Get out of here! Perfect dodging gives us more stuff, I guess. Underground just showed up. I saw a rocks on tank. All the roads out of Harlem are blocked. Where are you? Near your apartment. Trying to find shelter. Get to Dale's bodega. I'll be there soon. We'll keep everyone safe as long as we can. Gotta take care of them before I head back to Harlem. There were two bombs, I think. Okay, this is really a Venom jump situation. Venom punch is not broad enough. Of course, I got literally nobody. Oh! Get out of here. Who else is here? Another one! Can we get the other people first? That might be a bigger problem, actually. We can try the Mega Venom Blast? Well, I think we need three bars for that. Which I just got, but I value my health. Let's move away, maybe. Oh! Yes, the instant takedowns. Oh, what the hell, dude? Go ahead. Try and get up. I got him. He's hurt. Come on. I welcome you to keep trying. This is getting scary, though. Those gadget guys really freak me the heck out. I need to get to Harlem. Now, before Finn destroys the reactor. 